Peggy 18. I'm Rich Farley, I'm Senior Creative Director at ELA, working on Medal of Honor. Once the subject matter was agreed upon, it's a matter of, of going back to what made Medal of Honor great in the first place, and that's commitment to authenticity, respect for the soldier, and respect for the material, especially given the, the, the context that it's in right now. It is set in actual conflict, um, but it's a fictional story. It's about a fictional group of uh, group of soldiers and uh, the player gets to witness the events through, the, through the, the lens of these soldiers. We are very fortunate to have a number um, of, of actual Tier 1 operators that come to the studio and on a regular basis and look at our software and, and look at our designs, read our scripts, talk to us directly, we bounce ideas off them. We do a lot of research, we've talked to a lot of people, we've read a lot of books on the subject, what a certain area would look like or what people would be wearing or what language they'd be speaking. Um, we're very, very knowledgeable at this point on, on everything and it really shows in the game. You know, we try to differentiate between the characters that the player plays by uh, treating the world around them differently. Um, so when you're with a tier one unit, you know it because of the way they speak, the way they look, the way they, they move and act. You're with a, if you're with a ranger unit, you know, you know that you're with the ranger unit because it's the, the, the mood and the vibe is completely different. It's, you know. we're, we're all very excited. We're, we're all working very hard because there's a lot of work to be done. We really want to do, do right for the franchise and really bring it back into the conversation. So we want to, we want to arrive at ship time with a very competitive and very fun and very high quality game. So today was the first look at uh, Medal of Honor. Um, you know, we, we showed a little bit, and uh, there's still more to come. Um, stay tuned. Uh, you know, it, as as the, as we get closer to to launch, we're going to start releasing more and more information, and uh, it's uh, it's getting closer and closer. So uh, we can't wait to ship.